Hey, what's up, man? Look, I feel like, man, I don't know, this, this could probably be a podcast when I just think about certain shit and start talking about it. But, man, for some reason, I've been thinking about this, man. Like, it, it just came to my mind, and I just felt like, you know, start. You know, I just wanted to talk about it real quick. It's going to sound weird, but it's, it's interesting to me, like, how, you know, paper is white. White, like, get where I'm going with this. Like, you know how you sleep, right? To fully access that dream state, you have to actually darken everything around you. Like, lights have to be off. No distraction. No disturbance. Nothing. You should close your eyes. Complete darkness. But with darkness, there's actually light. There's creativity. You're, you manifest upon your mind. It, it, it's just like, it gets deeper than what you ever you would ever expect but like you literally have to be in a dark room or a dark space in order for you to you know to happen into your imagination to me i feel like there, there, there should be you know black paper why i say this it's like i feel like to me bright white paper is distracting it like it irritates your eye it doesn't really make you think because you're just distracted by this huge brightness. I just feel like with dark, dark or black paper, it calms your eyes. It calms your mind too. You're able to jot down more ideas, more in-depth ideas. You, you just feel more relaxed because it's just complete darkness. So you know how, you know on phones, right? Devices. You got dark mode. The reason why people use dark mode is because it's the light, the bright light, you know, messes up their eyesight, eye vision, or is, um, it, it, you know, it irritates them just in general. But when they put that dark mode on, they're more, more relaxed, more calm. They're able to, they're able to use their phone more because, you know, it's not irritating their eyes. It's just that, how do we have dark mode on devices? In order to sleep, you must have everything shut off, like light, close your eyes, dark. But we don't have black paper. I mean, dark paper, black paper. I feel like with that, you're able to jot down more memories. It's just, it feels, it feels better. You might say, how can you draw on dark paper? Easy. You get white ink. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, it's reversed. Like, it's white paper, but it's black ink or dark ink. But it should just be black paper, then white link, or just highlighted pens, or whatever. I just feel like with that, you know, with darkness, there's light. So you can draw light into the darkness of your paper. <laughs> it, it, this shit gets crazy, but, like, I think you understand uh, what I'm telling you. I feel like we should have transcended into dark paper if we if people still use paper at all. But it's just, like, I feel like it's more easier. Just, even on Word or document, like... Having a way where it's like, it's dark, but you're able to still type or write or whatever you do on there, but you're stay, still able to see it though. It's just like, I find it to be very interesting. Like I always say, throughout darkness, there's light. So I feel like dark paper, you're able to drop the, write down more stuff because you're literally tapping in more into your mind because you're in that calm state of mind so you're able to jot down more memories on the paper something like that but anyways yo this is podcast number one um like i always say as well we like goku the spirit bomb throwing it at the haze face also the major's face run a 2k subscribers as always one love to all peace out See, girl, that's how I use topic and logic in a sentence gonna keep up with my interest you know when to the poetic just gotta flow with it you know when i have to show off a bit these my words are legit i can't quit delivering these lines like a michael vick you might say wow his bars are super